Here we go again. Another trip away. This one's going to be successful. Third time lucky for 2020. It was Auckland anniversary weekend and we took Friday off to make it an extra long weekend. We had no real plans apart from the Maharangi Regatta on Saturday. What a memorable weekend it turned out to be. That pink brown muck in the water is actually bioluminescence. We sailed through so much of it on the Friday. Kind of looks quite mucky, but looks nice at night. Look at the state of the water, it's beautiful. We're behind Tiri, there's the lighthouse over there, and these are the rocks that often have seals on them. And hopefully, there's some kiddies down there because it's just past low tide. That's how calm it is. Cody's rowing us over to the spot. We're following. Oh, look, there's a steady spot. Guys, he swims fast. There's a seal over there swimming. Oh, there's two seals. Hopefully they stay over there. Is that on? I'll go over here. The bioluminescence ruined the visibility, so we decided to find a bay to park up in. The little cove on the southeast side of Motor Aura beckoned. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Is the water warm? Yeah, it's refreshing. I'm going. I'm going to go too. It's too hot. It would be rude not to. I'm Chris Taylor. Taylor and I with a tattoo around. I, I don't even do that. You do it, Coach. No, I'm not going to. Oh, why not? I'm trying to test if I can float first. Surprised. I can float. <laughs> Come on, Coach, show us. Cody's first time without his wetsuit on. He's floating. Yeah. Even without a wetsuit. Yeah. Imagine that. We came ashore for a bit of beach time. This is a bay that we had visited once before when we were an executor. It looks so pretty! It does! Can we go in it? I think so. Rock Falls are pretty cool, eh? Okay, you came around that way. Oh, I love it! You love Rock Falls? Yeah, we're going to catch the shell and Taylor saw a 
Okay, we're still on sand. It's big. We think it's alive. It's massive. We're back at Motara Island, which is just across the Isthmus. Now we're looking for Taylor's pink stone. A for real crystal. A for real crystal. Oh, yeah. Handsome swimming on this beautiful morning. Magic trick. Liberty Bobberty Room. <gasps> Taylor's got a wiggly too. We're gonna go over here and walk over here. Over to the bay with wreck in it. Walking, walking. And the shipwreck through there. Talking about the shipwreck and how it's ended up where it is. By explosive! But it was supposed to be out further across the entrance to the bay. Taylor's gonna go to snorkel the wreck. Wreck diver. Is it working? <laughs> Adam and I are rowing one oar each. Yeah, I think we're doing interestingly weird. Oh yeah, interestingly weird. <laughs> Cody's excited about seeing a wreck for the first time underwater. Second diver making their way in. Cody's first snorkeling. Now Adam's in. Good, Cody? Yep, I think that means yep. Two thumbs up. Along with half of Auckland, we pulled into Maharangi Harbour for the Maharangi Regatta. Dan and Alex were there on Calypso, and Dan had been racing John Call in the Regatta. You can see how packed Sullivan's Bay was. The meeting point was Scott's Landing. Boats spilled across from Scott's Landing right down the harbour and in all the little bays. We found a spot in Jamison Bay, which was pretty sheltered and right across from Scott's Landing. Hi! Hi. We're just having some food and these are going to the playground. And Calypso is like over there behind these boats. And we'll go over to Scott's Landing where all of these boats are. And there's a little bit of a party going on. Cody's captain. As As the tide came in, some of the dinghies even started drifting away. Dan won something. Dan won the Harris shot. The shield. Harris shot. <laughs> yeah, we've got it six times. Now we've got the moon river. Moon river's on yeah. it 2016, so. It was a mass exodus from Maharangi Harbour the next day. With no real plans, we followed the pack and then veered off to try our luck fishing again at the back of Tiri. Cody and I fishing. What's happening, Cody? We haven't got bites in the last 10 minutes. We haven't just really had any bites. <laughs> Cody's not impressed. There's boats all the way over there. There's boats all the way over there and we're kind of in the middle of them, so maybe we're in the wrong spot. They fish there, I used to be. 
Woody Bay was a much more appealing idea. Perfect anchoring. Are you a big snapper down there? Yeah. Like well, not big. Like ham sized. No, some of them might be legal. Cool. Taylor's <coughs> looking. Taylor's having a paddle ball. Wait, I'm getting off. Oh, no. <laughs> Southerly blew up, making it a bit uncomfortable in Woody Bay. We decided to move to the north side of Motahi for the last evening of our long weekend. It's <laughs> dinner while we watch Full House, the summer of Full House, and then the sun is setting, and it's very beautiful. Some boats have gone for the day. I'm here for the night. We're going up for a walk up Motorhe at 9.30. We're going to watch the fireworks. This is Taylor and me <laughs> in the pitch black and we're staring at the city and we're waiting for Auckland anniversary weekend fireworks. Yeah. Wow, it's amazing. like red, orange, green. Whoa. Whoa. Everyone's looking at the beach. See what sort of day it is. Do they like them? Yeah. Honey puffs. Bro, look at how fast they go. Millions of ducks. What did you call it? Duck attack. <laughs> You certainly do have all the ducks in the bay. Right, we're going to the beach. <laughs> they hang on the paddleboard. I'm going by dinghy. There's a demon ahead. Eyes on the prize. And they've made it. Lunch. Lunch ice cream. I wonder if there's going to be any ice cream left. Hopefully they've stocked up since yesterday. Oh Adam, yeah. look how calm it is on that side. Yeah, I know. I thought it was blowing on that side. Ice cream time. $18.20. We're eating ice creams at Motorhe and Taylor's got boys and berries. I got boys and berries. Mummy's got white chocolate and raspberry. White chocolate and raspberry. Daddy's also got a white chocolate and raspberry. Too shy. Okay, for a walk up the hill a little bit to see what the view looks like. And 
and now I'm going back down because it's middle road and I didn't have shoes and it's really hot. And we're going to head off home soon, back to Gulf Harbour, clean the boat. And that is the end of Auckland Anniversary Weekend. I like that food. <laughs> Who's leaping in my bed? <laughs> and Storm has found the sinkers. We're heading home. We've left Motorhead. We're heading past Ragino. Back to Gold Harbour. Be successful, eh? Was it hot stomach hitting? No, I don't think so. Yeah, I did that too. No, I don't think so. Really found Thor's hammer. Oh. 